Hi, this is Joel Berman for Mortgage News Network. I'm here in Las Vegas, Nevada at NAM National, and I have the pleasure of being with Kelly Cruz, Senior Vice President of Flagstar, and I'd like to welcome you to the Mortgage News Network Broadcast Plaza and just thank you for your support of the wholesale industry and the mortgage broker in particular. What brings you here and why is Flagstar so committed to the wholesale channel? Uh, our bread and butter is on the wholesale side. Um, we've been in this business for three decades now. Uh, we cut our teeth on it. Um, it's a great opportunity for us uh, to get together with our current business partners as well as meet the, the new um, regime that's out there and uh, hopefully get them signed up with Flagstar. Now, one of the things that uh, you and I spoke before we went on camera was that the wholesale industry and the mortgage broker went down to numbers that uh, were drastically reduced during the financial crisis. Do you see the growth and the return and strength of both the wholesale channel and the mortgage broker in the past year? Yeah, we're definitely seeing uh, growth in the in the broker channel. Um, today it represents about 28 percent of our total volume. Um, it is uh, yeah, the barrier to entry, obviously, uh, with the CFPB and the new licensing rules, um, we're seeing a better quality um, customer out there, better quality LO. Um, I think now that um, people have gotten trid underneath their belt, they're they're feeling confident in uh, where they've folded up underneath a larger company. They're feeling confident to go back out and start their own business again. Now you mentioned that. Uh Trid and and the wonderful word, uh, the C word that all of us are fearful of, fearful of in compliance. How do you feel uh, compliance has affected the industry? And one of the things you just mentioned, and I want you to kind of discuss a little bit more, is that once you learn how to deal with it, do you feel that it hasn't been that difficult to overcome some of the compliance issues? I would say in the beginning, um, it was extremely difficult for everybody involved. Um, I don't care who you are, if you're a bank, uh, if you're a, a non-mortgage bank, a broker, correspondent. Um, there was a lot of um, moving parts with TRID. Um, there was a lot to get used to. I would say probably just in the last couple months, uh, we're seeing far fewer mistakes um, on the loans that are coming in. Um, has it helped? Uh, yes, I, I think it's helped. Um, did it go a little overboard? Pretty much, <laughs> I would say it, it, it went a little bit overboard. Um, you know, one of the things that we're doing is now that we're seeing the comfort level with our customer base is uh, on the broker side is we're getting ready to uh, have the CD come out prior to a clear to close, as well as going back to pre-trid, um, giving the ability back to the broker uh, to be able to pull their own docs and their own CD off of our website. So the sum and substance of, and summary or the Cliff Notes version of what you said is, once you understand how to deal with these regulations, it really doesn't impact the process as much as people thought at the beginning. I think it impacts the process for the borrower. Um, it's, it's become more lengthy uh, as far as getting the loan from point A to point B. Um, but once, you know, from a, uh, from a loan officer perspective, um, once you've done, you know, several loans, it, it's becoming more common um, for them to get, get through. It's not as new as it was um, over a year ago. And off of that question, what does Flagstar do in particular in the wholesale channel to help the mortgage broker navigate some of these new compliance requirements and so on and help them both understand it and get through it? We're you know, obviously we're a highly regulated bank. Uh, we have a very strong infrastructure on the risk management and compliance side. Uh, we're extremely reliable. You know, we feel like we're a good partner for the broker base because um, we can bring, bring them that um, ease of doing business as well as um, being able to get them trained and show them through the, the entire process. Now, Flagstar is here at NAM National. You're supporting the mortgage broker community, uh, and you're hoping to validate your relationships with people you do business with that come, and new people that you meet, and so on. How valuable do you think attending these functions are, and membership in the NAMB, for people that are not here and that are not members of the MBA, both on the broker side as well as the loan officer side? 
I think it's extremely valuable. Um, you know, we would like to see more of um, our customer base, the brokers' correspondents getting involved with the national associations as well as their state associations, um, if for anything, to see what's going on out there. Um, obviously, we're in a very highly regulated um, climate right now, um, and it's always good to get um, together with your counterparts to see, you know, what people are doing, how they're um, combating some of the, the new regulations that, that are out there. Um, so, not to mention, it's it's always good to support um, your your bread and butter. <laughs> Without question, that's going to end it for Mortgage News Network and Joel Berman. I'm here with Kelly Cruz, and it's a sign off. Thank you. This is Mortgage News Network.